So you've seen how I use a knife a lot of the time. And um, there are many painters who, use, who, who will use the knife very quickly, large fluid strokes. It's beautiful. You know, it's like watching a dance in a way. It's, it's quite something. Um, I'm more meticulous, a little fussier, a little slower. Almost all the time. So, that relates to what I'm just going to talk about right here briefly. With a lot of the forms in, 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 uh, in my painting, what I'll do, and this I think illustrates it well, is I'm not 100% sure exactly what level of value uh, uh, I want to have, uh, how high my values are going to be in certain areas. So what I'll do is, I mentioned this briefly I think before, I'll, I'll set my low values where I want them, my high values where I want them, but my high values won't be really high. They'll just be sort of mid-tones. Where I'm sure it's going to be darker, I'll set in darker tones and work my way lighter. Now, also what happens when I first lay these colors in is there are a lot of small strokes and it becomes a very busy looking area. Once, once I have most of those strokes laid in and it looks too busy, I'll join many of those strokes together and maybe put a curve on them, smear them around a little bit, try to, trying to make it look a little more natural, a, a little bit calmer. Then, once I have, once I'm happy with my design and have removed, you know, I still have, you know, hundreds of little dark, dark areas these lines showing but at least it's not thousands <laughs> so once once I'm pretty happy with that then I'll go in and I'll lay in my highest values topping off trees here and there even these trees here I haven't laid in my highest values yet uh, and it's and these are dry enough now that, that they have for the most part a bit of a skin over it that's okay paint's still only a couple days old I'm, once this is done, I'm going to take care of all of these. I, this, I'll have enough information here, I'll know what to do here. Um, so it's like one part of the painting bounces off the other part of the painting. I don't always know exactly what level, what, what values I want where until I've painted in a certain area. And as you can see in this painting, I'm really working on the periphery, working my way to the central area. Uh, as does a coward. <laughs> On occasion, I actually start in the middle and work my way out. But this time I'm not doing that. I know these are going to catch light in areas. I'm, I'm pretty convinced this ridge here is going to be a little bit lighter and, and the, the, the design will change slightly of this area. Yeah, anyway, I thought I'd explain that. I hope I'm making that clear enough. Um, if you're not sure, Start with your mid-values. The areas you think are going to be high, start with mid-values, work your way brighter. Your dark areas, lay them in dark, darker than you anticipate needing them to be. And still work your way lighter, if you need to be. You know, the odd time I've laid in something too light, and I will scrape it off, and I'll lay a, a dark, darker paint over it, a lower value paint over it. That's fine, but it's more of a pain in the butt. and it, It's more of a pain in the butt than doing it the other way around. Okay, blither blither. Just a, a quick chat there. Well, this is what happens when I lose my way. Um, still have a little bit of housekeeping to do here. I think this is all okay. And then I came to here, which is a pretty important area. Uh, <laughs> I ended up going far too light in this area and dark here and I debated for a while whether this should be light and that should be dark anyway it looks just kind of like a mess and a mishmash right now I've already scraped off paint in all of this area um, and I've used uh, some toilet paper to withdraw most of the paint from the canvas now it has to sit and uh, tomorrow I'm going to um, fix this. Now it's not it's not way out to lunch but it's not in the right direction. In this area of the painting 
in this area of the painting there has to be a lot of strength that's not strength well there I uh, just started some triage on the painting to reestablish some uh, shapes there <laughs> okay